This is my beta fish named Bozo. Bozo likes to spend his time hiding behind his rock or watching humans. Sometimes, though, Bozo feels adventurous and goes for a drive. Fish Tank is the latest fish operated vehicle which allows Bozo to travel the world on land. Powered by a Raspberry Pi, this vehicle combines image processing with robotics. Fish Tank is paired with its driver's station, a Python QT GUI, which provides full control and debugging power over the fish tank. Using a USB webcam, Fish Tank will track Bozo's location and direction. When Bozo is both near a wall of his tank and facing towards it, Fish Tank will move in Bozo's desired direction. However, to get his location and direction, we will need some image processing. The first part of our image processing pipeline is to locate and contour Bozo. We can first crop the raw webcam image to our predetermined region of interest, which is the internal walls of the fish tank. This removes any distracting artifacts that aren't Bozo, including most of his reflections on the tank walls. Next, binarize the image using a hue saturation variance threshold. Since Bozo is blue, we can set the fish tank lights to red, so Bozo stands out from his surroundings. We can finish this step off with an open filter to remove random small blobs and noises. Now that we have a clean binary image, we can find each contour in its bounding box. Filter out any contours that are too small in either length, width, or area. Finally, with the remaining contours, we can assume that the largest one is Bozo. Bozo's contour gives us his location, but we still need to figure out which direction he's facing. Using the second image moments, fit an ellipse onto Bozo's contour blob. The major axis of the ellipse tells us which angle Bozo is aligned to. However, we don't know if this angle is heads or tails. To find this, we can assume that the side his head is on is wider than the side his tail is on. Divide the ellipse in half through the minor axis. Using the halves as two separate masks, create two masked out images of Bozo's blob. Count the remaining number of pixels in each of these images to figure out which side is larger. The larger side will tell us exactly which angle Bozo's head is facing. Now that we're able to extract the data we need from each image, let's discuss the fish tank hardware. The frame of the robot is 3D printed. The drivetrain uses mechanum wheels, which allows the robot to move in all directions. These wheels are driven using high torque stepper motors. Hardware components, like the stepper motor and NeoPixel lights, are controlled with an Arduino and motor driver shield setup. The Raspberry Pi can control this Arduino by sending commands over USB UART. The entire robot is powered with a 3S lithium polymer battery, which operates on 11 volts. Power is stepped down to 5 volts with a buck converter to power the Raspberry Pi.